What's good gamers? I am back unfortunately for you guys. That's right I'm here to annoy you every single day with more daily uploads. Sorry about the trash audio quality this past week I was out but I'm back and since you guys smashed like so many times on our video I will tell you the name of the orange cat that likes lasagna in Garfield. His name is Orange cat that likes lasagna. That is right guys. Thank you so much. Let's get into the video I love you and if this video gets five likes I will reveal the name of the princess in the Legend of Zelda All right, thank you. Let's get started right now I'm just trying to get it down with one of the Kanto starters. So I'm just going back and forth This is the classic dappled grove place. I'm sure you guys have seen a million times it's super easy to find and get to wow That is an ore beetle <laughs> Oh my god. Alright, finally got a freaking den. This took forever, guys. Now, if you get, like, an event den, you can do the um, the time exploit. I'm super stubborn, so I'm, I'm not going to do it. But we do have a war turtle here. So I'm going to show you guys the easiest way to take these things down. I mean, I, like I said, I'm late, so... I'm sure you guys have it figured out by now. Now, if you guys have like a Mewtwo or something from Let's Go or anything like that, definitely just teach Mewtwo like a fire, ice, and like electric move and like a crazy move pool. You'll be good. But just something that you all can access. I'm going to use Eternatus. And uh, I'm just going to click Do Not Invite Others. Man, you guys already know. You can just take this thing out so easily, so quick. Um, and you could do this with all the Kanto starters and just grind life orbs, toxic orbs, flame orbs. And you could just stock up on them. Get a bunch of good, like, EV berries, too. You get berries to decrease uh, EV stats, which is really important uh, for Pokemon Home. Now that you guys have Pokemon Home, and, or now that we have Pokemon Home and stuff, you definitely want to uh, save up and stock up on those EV reducing berries so you can EV train Pokemon you get from Pokemon Home that may have already been EV trained. You want to get rid of those, you know, get rid of those freaking EVs. But I'm just going to Dynamax Cannon this thing. You already know. Not a bit, nothing too big. And yeah, like, we already, we already took half this thing out. Like, it's not too much of a guide. It's more just to make you guys aware that uh, this, is, this is actually a thing. You know what I'm saying? Like, why it's kind of important. So, uh, this is mainly important for the EV inducing or uh, reducing berries. Uh, and with, I'm going to make a separate guide on that with Pokemon Home. How to, like, utilize EV reducing berries and make, like, competitive Pokemon from Pokemon Home. Uh, and I'm going to do that right after my Mewtwo guide that's coming out really soon. Actually, I don't even know if it'll be a guide at this point because I have to go to work. So, it'll more <laughs> mostly be like, a, hey, I did this type thing. But I really want to solo Mewtwo. I think I have it. Uh, if you guys watch the whole video, stick around. I'm going to show you my setup that I'm going to be using a solo Mewtwo. But um, I'm just kind of talking while we take this thing down. Anyways, this thing's little a shell. What is it called? This thing's little uh, barrier broke. And we're just going to catch it right here. Let's see what rewards we get. Uh, here we go. Shoot. Catch. And we'll just use a... Why do I have 33 Master Balls? Oh, my God. Um, I'll just use a Netball. And let's just catch this thing. Hopefully it's not too hard. I don't really know what the catch rate is. Cool. Got it. Uh, netball is really cool. Netball is super slept on. I saw that they're selling like exclusive TCG dive balls. I really want to get that. Anyways. <laughs> uh, yeah, so cool. We got the life orb. This is a re regular raid. This is just a regular common raid. We got a freaking life orb, which is so dope. We got our berries. Um, we got Scald, Surf, Hydro Pump, a bunch of cool stuff, uh, which is really dope. And you guys can just farm this for the remainder of the day what is it a sunday so i know a lot of people are off of school off of work and a bunch of cool stuff like that so yeah you guys just go back and forth you get like i said if you guys don't know about the um how the like event den exploit works now i don't usually use exploits a lot because i have a lot of free time and whatever but if you guys don't have a lot of free time you guys can get an event den go and do the time thing and like if you get a toxicity you can do the exploit and roll over i don't really like covering exploits though but um now we have a bulbasaur here so i'm gonna take this thing down just because we got it <laughs> i was gonna end the video but might as well just take down the bulbasaur see what rewards we can get and uh, i think i think oh it's an ivy store oh man this thing looks so good inside this game I, man, I love it. Sword of Shield's looking really cool. I'm excited for like all the um whatchamacall, all the DLC and stuff to be out. This game is like shaping up to be very awesome. And I think once the full game is like a thing, being like the DLC, I think it's gonna be a, <laughs> why is he so close to my face? <laughs> I think it's gonna be a game that we all like remember for a while. I think it's gonna age very well. I'm gonna Dynamax, I'm gonna max Hailstorm though. And this is my this is my Kyurem build that I'm going to be trying to take down Mewtwo with. Um, hopefully. I don't know. I, I'm scared. But I actually recorded me catch getting it on Pokemon Home, using EV reducing berries, giving it a bunch of protein and stuff. So, oh my god. This thing is insane. This is such a cool Pokemon. <laughs> what the frick? Yo, Kyurem was gas. Um, so here we go. Oh. And then it's going to break it to its shield, I'm assuming. 
And we got the Max Hailstorm as well. Ooh, I just realized that's gonna be a problem for the Mewtwo raid if everybody's dying from hail. Yes, <laughs> we'll have to rethink that one. <laughs> um, I'm just gonna max overgrowth and kill myself. All right, cool, we took it down. Let's see what rewards we get from catching this little guy. Um, or big guy, I guess. <laughs> I guess I'll use a nest ball? I don't know, I don't really know what ball to use. I don't really have like any good ones. <laughs> I mean, this thing is a lot lower level than my Kyurem, so hopefully we can get, catch it. <laughs> All right, cool, we caught it. I think even if you just run away, you'll still get the rewards. I just remembered that, but cool, we got a Toxic Orb. And keep in mind, guys, these are common raids. These aren't even like rare raids or anything. And we got a bunch of berries, Energy Ball, uh, Grass Knot, and Leaf Storm, which is a really good move. Um, so yeah, this is some awesome grinding. I really like the, the grindy type stuff they're implementing. I wish the raids were harder though. I love the hard YouTube raids, I really do. Before we end, I, hopefully I, I, I'm assuming I'll show a picture of this anyways, but here's all the drops and stuff, the rarity guides, and a bunch of awesome stuff like that. You can see what actually comes up in the den. I think Mewtwo, oh yeah, Grim, I forgot Grimstar was a promoted raid. My Grimstar video started doing really well all of a sudden. I was like, what is going on? <laughs> but um, anyways, yeah, so here's all the cool stuff you guys can uh, get from these actual drops. I'll leave a link down below. Um, so you guys can look at this yourself. I'm sorry I'm so late. Like I said, I was out on vacation. I did not know this is happening, but uh, I'm not going anywhere. It's actually grind season. I'm gonna be working hard, uploading every single day, and I'm gonna be doing some really creative stuff. My hair is ugly. I'm ugly. I'm gonna end the video and cry. Love you guys. Thank you for watching. Um, and make sure you tuck your homies in. Okay, that was not funny. Goodbye. <laughs>